Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel, we're on here and yeah, today I'm going to be playing the Dark Pictures House of the Ashes game. So, uh, I think, th yeah, this is the first time that I play uh, this series. I mean, I bought the first game, but I didn't even uh, play it yet. I mean, uh, yeah, I, I know there's a DLC and this is it, with the hope. And yeah, this is the third game. I'm not sure if they are linked or what uh, or not. But yeah, I didn't. I didn't play the first game at all. I mean, probably this is a standard. Uh, this is a standalone story or something. Maybe yeah, each of them are different story. Mostly, I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, I think so. Mm. Yeah, never mind. Um, yeah, I will play. Or I will play this for you guys, and maybe uh, if there is a link between all these games, maybe I will go back and play the first game and the second game, and then post it on my channel. So yeah, enough talk. Let's do this. Embark on your own single player story. Play with friends. Yeah, it's better to just. Play alone, so let's go. Okay, new story. Challenging lethal. Death is inevitable. Your skills will be tested. Uh, Challenging, I guess. I mean, I, I never played the series before, so. Silence! Your words are meaningless here. Your blood will pay the debt our king demands. Your sacrifice will lift his curse from our land. General Barato! Forgive me, my lord. The king demands your urgent presence. The gods smile on you. For now. Take this one back to his cell. I'll deal with him later. You're in luck, Gutian. Luck? No. No luck for these dogs. General, we should leave this place. The king, his madness threatens to swallow us all. This temple is cursed. I'd rather die in this cursed house than perish to the plague and famine out there. We have our orders, Captain. The moon god sends you to destroy my kingdom. I know it, girl. I see everything. Look around you. Is this hall not famous enough for my mistakes? Do the gods not bask in its glory? The Gutians are coming, General. The moon god sends an army to destroy us. I shall muster our forces immediately. Good. And what news from below? 
There are hundreds of prisoners, my king. Their sacrifice will take time. Time is no longer in our hands. No matter. The blood of this army will nourish the sands. The sacrifice will be fulfilled. Starting with this one. Tell me, General. Does she remind you of anyone? My king? Do you not see a hint of your own daughter in her? What age would she have been now? Eighteen. Eighteen. Hmm. What a tragedy this plague has been. Kill her. Uh, what the fuck? I don't know where. My king, would it not be wise to keep the girl alive? She's an enemy scout. We could learn the Gutian's plans. No. Every drop of blood brings us closer to salvation. She must die. <laughs> <laughs> Do not have to attack. Guys, let me check something. Um, yeah, I want to turn all the subtitle because I thought I thought yeah, it says that minimum. I thought I, yeah, I set it of minimum and I thought it will show all. So, fucking hell, man. And I want it to show all. Yeah.
Give me strength. the temple at the pool. He builds this temple to call for forgiveness. But the gods don't listen. And now he too is silent. Even my daughter's death couldn't wake me to the truth. I followed a fool into the abyss. Don't let his ruin become ours. This is your temple. What can we do? There is a way out through the catacombs. You think I should trust you? You have no choice. I found you! with this. I don't know, I don't even know what is this for. Just a rat. 
Odd's death. For nothing. They died in vain. For a mad king. Uh, to pick up all chat, okay. Guess we can find it. Seriously, I don't, I don't like the fucking camera thing display. I don't like, I don't like that at all. I mean, the... the movie, movie format cutscene. I seriously don't like that. God damn it! Um, I don't think I can change it. Okay. You have only made choices with your hardware possible. We are cursed by our own actions. Why did your king create the temple? Same story that history has taught us. For gold, for glory, for greed. I mean, what, I want to see what the, what the information said, but it disappeared very quickly. I couldn't even, couldn't even read it, finish reading it, and it disappeared. I don't like this fucking stupid, stupid movie format. Okay. Okay. I mean, this is a bit like. This is a bit light until dawn. Okay, I mean, there's some someone will climb climb out from that hole probably. Think here. This is the door that. That I came from. Yeah, I couldn't even run at all. Okay, probably that's more here. Here, help me with this. First, we're safe down here. You first. What is this that adorns you? The history of Gutian. You are guardians fought hard to destroy our people. But mark my words, our story has just begun. How do we get out of here alive? Uh The enemy of my enemy is a friend. Oh, okay. So just now I thought I missed missed some buttons, but this is just to check a rela relationship with this guy. Okay. Uh... We help each other. There is 
always hope. What was that? How many ways into this tomb? We're not alone down here. I mean, I'm just double checking if there is anything. Probably nothing. So. Over here. No escape. Our only hope is to stand together. No! If we both run, then we both die. Ready your sword! Uh fight. Fuck man, I mean I mean can 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 I can I fucking can I fucking survive survive that? I mean I already pressed the, the square button but it fell. God damn it. Hold it. Hold Won't you spare me over till another
Jupiter on the edge of an abyss. Your survival depends on the choices you make. They will be as a compass guiding you through the unknown. Will you find the path to salvation or be lost in the darkness forever? Let me speak plainly. You're about to make some difficult decisions. Decisions that will affect the lives of others. How those decisions play out will become clear over time. I expect you're wondering who I am and where you are. I am the curator, the custodian of tales. My purpose is to keep a record of everything you do, every decision or mistake you make. This is my repository. It's filled with untold stories. Stories about friends and enemies, loyalty and betrayal, life and death. Understand that I am not here to help you. Although I have been known to bend the rules from time to time. To descend into the unknown alone is extremely brave. Or extremely foolish. Perhaps there is more to you than meets the eye. Let me give you a few words of advice. Throughout the story, you will encounter certain pictures Pictures which allude to possible outcomes. I suggest you pay attention to their meaning. It could foreshadow a future best avoided. But alas, the sands of time have run out for us. We'll meet again soon to see how you fare. Or fail. Trip. Not particularly. Welcome to Camp Slayer. You're early. Mm. Apologies for arriving early, Lieutenant. Things are moving fast. I hear you, Colonel. I'm glad to have you on board. What the hell is this? I'm intrigued. Again, it's the relationship thing, not. So it is it is some it was something new so I mean just now I, I, I pressed the, the square button and uh, not the circle button but it still died I mean maybe I missed it I, I don't know I mean I th thought I have successfully pressed it yeah because I pressed it too a bit slow so man you have to like keep focusing on the buttons that will suddenly pop out uh, on the screen, I mean. Uh, okay. Insecure, loyal, rational, hopeful. The limb. Okay. Okay. As soon as we get word from the CEO, we're good to go. You should read this. Didn't you hear? There's a new king in the castle. Looks that way. You are? 
is my assistant, Clarice Stokes. Dr. Clarice Stokes. Cold check. First lieutenant, cold check. Well, the briefing room? What's up, Maureen? Can't you keep up? This could be our last time together, Rachel. After what happened at the checkpoint, uh, I thought I was done. These last few weeks, you've, you've lifted me up. I don't know where I'd be without you. Rachel King? Colonel King has arrived on base, ma'am. He's en route to the briefing room. I'll be there in five. Fuck, it's him. He's early. Your husband, you mean? Don't you think it's about time you came clean? Put your clothes back on. Straighten up. All right, Rachel. Are you going to tell him about us or what? You and Eric have been apart for a year. Whatever you had, it, it's got to be over. Come on. Uh... Baby, I just don't think this is the right time. That's bullshit. There's never a right time. Soon, Nick. I promise. Soon. I'll see you at the briefing. Shit. You have to excuse the noise and disorder. We're just getting the base set up. Hmm. It blows my mind. Only a few weeks ago, Saddam was living it up in here. <laughs> Chowing down on candy bars while some poor bastard clipped his toenails. Nice image. Uh, if only you could see the state of this place now. It makes me smile. <laughs> you got the CIA. You got the Army, the Marines, DIA, the Air Force. Hey, everyone's invited. Everyone wants a piece of history. God bless America. Okay, I couldn't go anywhere. I mean, he's... I don't understand, man. Even the gameplay is like cinema mode. I mean, come on, man. This is like fucking bullshit. I really hate this thing. It is stupid fucking thing, I mean. Uh, yeah, no way for me to. I don't think there's a way for me to like. Want to change that? Um, fucking hell! I see you, old man. Keep busting out those reps. Hey, you come join me. Maybe I'll teach you a thing or two. Later. We have company. Yeah, maybe Miss here would like to watch me get my sweat on. Huh? You wanna spot me, little lady? We'll see you just fine from here, thanks. Ignore Corporal Merwin. He likes social skills. Uh, I guess every unit has its resident jackass. Sergeant K. There's Lieutenant Colonel Kane. Just taking him down to the briefing room. Yeah, gotta go get prepped. I'll see you in there, Marine. So, what's his malfunction? Nick ain't been himself lately. We got caught up in a shooting a few weeks back. Civilian ate a bullet. Nick took it hard. Is he combat ready? He's a big boy, sir. He's ready.
Damn, Joey, they got you sitting behind a desk? You want me to make a call? Nah, I'm all good. People who sit behind desks don't tend to catch so many bullets, you know? So this must be uh, the one and only satellite guy. Mm. <laughs> the one and only satellite guy. I'm Eric King. Lieutenant Colonel Eric King. Give the Colonel full sight access. Sir. I'm telling you, when the queen bitch finds out about this, she's gonna flip her shit. Uh... Rachel and I, we know each other. She'll understand all's fair in love and war. Sir? The queen bitch you're referring to is his wife. Nice work, Hotshot. Sir, I'm so sorry. Rachel never said she was married. We've been working apart this last year. So, she's the queen bitch now. She's gone up in the world. If it helps, we like to think of it as a term of endearment. Brett, let's get you shut up. I hope the bandwidth can cope with the data. I'll leave the techie stuff to you. And I'll leave the heavy lifting to you. We got a deal, lady. What is this place, anyway? Looks like an old ballroom. Uh, that's exactly what it is. I guess Shadam liked to get down on the dance floor. I think if his dance partner stepped on his foot, it'd be an instant off with her head. <laughs> well, it wouldn't surprise me. Maybe when we're done, I'll let you spin me around a little. As long as you don't step on my foot. Mm. Colonel King. Mrs. King. Eric, this is my team. And if you want to brief them, you clear it with me first. Mm. I should have warned you I was moving the briefing forward. That's on me. But things escalated, I had to move fast. I have a duty to my team to stay ahead of the curve. I understand, Rachel, but CENTCOM has given their orders. Orders? I'm now commanding officer. I didn't mean for you to find out like this. Truly. I'm sorry, Rachel. Somehow I doubt that very much. This is from Sock Central. It confirms that Lieutenant Colonel King has assumed control of this operation. I'm gonna need access to your network. I'll patch you through. Name? Dr. Stokes. You can call me Clarice. Dr. Stokes, please prepare the presentation. You found something? What the fuck is that? Modern art or something? This is footage from the highly classified Kalis program. That's supposed to mean something to me. It's a thermal satellite system that I personally pioneered. Oh, well, I'm impressed. Please, pioneer away. You behave like this in all your briefings, Corporal? Boys are just eager to catch a break, sir. No harm meant. Very well. Satellite sweeps of the war zone have uncovered what appears to be an underground storage facility. This will, of course, require further investigation, but I strongly suspect 
It's where Saddam's chemical weapons are hidden. We got you, you son of a bitch. CENTCOM has given the green light to raid the facility and seize any weapons on site. Hostilities may be over, but there are holdout groups of Republican Guard all over the country. They could deploy those weapons at any time, so we need to move fast. The Army is giving us a ride out there in their helos. On arrival, Lieutenant Kolchak will lead the raid on the facility. Once it's secured, we'll carry out a full weapons inspection. Now listen up. There's been a change of leadership, but Rachel's operational expertise and local knowledge is just as valuable as ever. She'll be flying with us, and I want you all to show her the same respect. Any questions? What the fuck we waiting for? I'm ready. That's tribal territory out there, Colonel. Make no mistake, those people are feral. I take it we're getting their support? Nah, too many birds could bring them down on us. We move fast in, fast out. Yeah, that's pretty much what your mama said to me. Hey, careful, boy. If I didn't pull out so fast, I could have been your papi. <laughs> All right, that's enough, Merwin. Sir, what's your call? Uh, fuck, man. We keep this thing small. If it goes south, I'll pull the plug and we can bug out. With all due respect, I think that's the wrong call. With all due respect, Lieutenant Kolchak, it's not your decision to make. This feel right to you? Merwin has a point. If we spin up too many helos, we'll increase our chance of being spotted. Any concerns, see me after the briefing. We go dark until weapons are secured. If we don't break radio sounds within 24 hours, CENTCOM will mount a rescue operation. A lot of shit can go down in 24 hours. I'll quit being a bitch. I'm just saying, that's all. This is why we went to war. This is what gets us out of bed every morning. Make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, this is how we stop Saddam from using these weapons. Be ready in one hour. Dismissed. Larisse, help me stop the equipment. I'm on it. I don't know, man. This don't feel right. I'm getting this tingle down the back of my neck. Oh, sweetie. Look, good rub down will sort that right out, huh? I'm serious. I've got a real bad feeling about this. That's what you get from spending too much time with Eric. Is there anything you can do? I'm going to download the latest satellite data. You can have some alone time with him. Thank you, Clarice. Eric, we need to talk. There's something I have to tell you. You should know. It wasn't my decision to take over your operation. It's been a long time since we last saw each other. Eric. Please, let me finish. Not a day went by when you weren't on my mind, when I didn't want you by my side. I've missed you so much, Rach. This isn't about us, Eric. I just want things to go back to the way they were. How we left it? Things weren't so great between us. We've been through worse. A lot worse. <sighs> Nothing has changed, Eric. You know that. You and I, there is no you and I. It's over. Please, Rach, don't say that. You're not wearing your wedding ring. <clears throat> hey, be careful with that. Oh, shit, sorry. What you got in that box of tricks anyway? The fuck is that? Ultraviolet light. We use it to sweep for explosives. Let me have a go. No. How much longer for that download, Clarice? I need it ASAP. It's five minutes ASAP enough for you? Downloading data now. Good. I'm gonna check the satellite maps. Not the greatest bandwidth. We work with what we have. Can you sign this 1348? Huh? Equipment release form. Can you... 
Oh, sure. Check all equipment, then check it again. Yeah, I hear you. I mean, I seriously should have called for air support. I think I, think I fucked up there. Yeah, I mean you guys can stop it and read it. Good. Stay focused. You think we'll bag Chemical Ali at this facility? He's in the vicinity. We'll get him. <laughs> that almost makes it worth the risk. Almost. Well, you know. I'd still rather be sitting behind a desk. Sir, I've heard some fucked up stories about the border. You sure you don't want air support? There's a chance we'll need them. We have the element of surprise on our side. I will not allow anything to jeopardize that. Please, Colonel. Can we take a step back and think about this for a minute? I've made my decision. You feeling lucky, Lance Corporal? Well, my parents owned a horse named Lucky. He ran away. Bet the farm on this. I have a good feeling we're going to clear up. I wish I shared your optimism, Colonel. Well, can I change change my choice? I really need that ass to vote. Um, when did I, did I write this? I mean, I got a lot of things to check. I don't have to like waste time reading all this. Make it show and get this thing. Open it now. Already talked to this guy, so. Did I talk to him? What the hell do we need this crap for? We need to be mobile. We need to be prepared. The facility is underground, possibly under construction. It's safer this way. You want me to feel safe? You give me some more shooters. Uh... So, you're my technician. I've heard about you. I should fucking hope so. I'm here to keep our gear in check. And if any Iraqis pop their heads up, I'll take them clean fucking off. You seem pretty confident, Corporal. If you need any assistance with the climbing gear, I'm here to help. I'm sure I'll manage, Colonel. Climbing gear. Fucking pencil pusher. I think it is. WP, sir. White phosphorus? It's just for popping smoke. That's all. These are only to be used for cover. Understood? Understood. After all, Saddam is the one who's breaking weapons conventions. Not us.
I mean, that's alright, I couldn't move anywhere. Yep. Downloads complete. Let's get to the helos. What? What? You want to ask me something? I can tell by that look on your face. What do you think of him? I take it you're talking about the skipper? He's a nice guy. Around here, nice don't cut it. What do you think of him? Like he's got something else on his mind? Zane, and a gate. Then. I mean, fuck, man. I didn't. I didn't even get the chance to like search the whole room just now. I mean, there must be a time limit to, to like check check the stuff. So, I'm not going to like read all of this. I mean, you guys can like stop it and then read it yourself. Ah. Uh. What the hell? Ways, are we? Mm, I mean, it's a bit hard to see. I think. Wait. I thought I saw something blinking. Zane? Salim. Salim. Salim Garkun. Abu Zain. Abu. Where are you? I forgot. He was Zain with with. He was Zain with your brother. Tariq. Yes, Tariq. They are together. They went to لا لا كله تمام اصل كان عيد ميلاده وانا جبت له هديه هديه كويسه اه لما يرجع ابعتهولي حالا 
ما اقدرش اقول امتى هيجوا انت عارف الولاد اي وقت ابعتوا لي لو سمحتي طبعا لا 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 يا ديني مش دلوقتي اوه كابتن بصري اهلا انا مو لازم لازم اتحرك على طول انت بتقول ايه سعادتك؟ العدو جاي يا سليم العدو جاي علينا دلوقتي العدو؟ يا فندم الحرب خلصت خلاص وخسرنا لا ده كلام فارغ محدش اتسلم العدو جاي ودي ارضنا واحنا لازم نتعرب ليها شايفينهم؟ مطلوب تاكيد يلا شوف جايين علينا بقول لك احنا محتاجين كل راجل في مكانه لاحسن طايرتهم توصل عندنا. ما اقدرش اعمل ده يا فندم. ابني محتاجني. ده امر يا جندي مش طلب. ده واجب عليك. فهمت. قلبي قريب خلاص يا دار دي اخر مهمه I got shit ton more of those bad boys lined up. Yeah, that's what your mama said. You two want to cut the bullshit and focus on the mission? Hey, only one place I let a woman boss me around like that, all right? And that's between the sheets. I'm surprised your mom lets women into your bedroom. Don't want her getting jealous now. Yeah, man. <laughs> hey, the fuck y'all laughing at? Sergeant K, I need you to establish contact with the AWACS CP on four-hour intervals. Sergeant K, are you with me? Yeah, I got it. Contact CP every four hours. Uh. Hey, you okay? Yeah, I'm straight. What's going on in there? Just some shit I gotta work through, man. It's all good. I'm chill. Okay. The hell? And... I got your back, Nikki. No matter what. I know it. Make sure you do. Semper Fi! Semper Fi. Semper Fi? What's that, some kind of Boy Scout thing? It's a Marine thing. It means always loyal. So what, it's supposed to be lucky? Marines have a boatload of superstitions. Hit me with one. All right, check it out. They say to never look back when you're disembarking the helo. Otherwise, you curse the whole team. That's got to be about the stupidest thing I have ever heard. Yeah, well, maybe. But as I see it, why take a chance? Eyes forward at all times. You look backwards in a war zone. It's no wonder you get your ass shot off. Good to go, Marines. It's what we were sent here to do, and may God be my witness, we're gonna succeed. Amen to that, brother. Hoorah! Hoorah! Captain! 
Close your neck. Ha ha ha! It's the best thing to do with you. Let's go. Let's go. الامريكان العساكر الامريكان قم sir we've been made awaiting orders cautious bend out and hold fire we're gonna psyops this shit احنا الامريكان احنا الجيش الامريكاني Down is secure. Prisoners are playing ball. Roger. Get Corporal Merwin to pop yellow smoke at the LZ and bring in the Colonel. This rig's a bust. These people are not the enemy, they're just shepherds. Lieutenant Kolchak, set rep if you will. No shots fired, sir. No casualties. Farm is secure and we're processing captives. Captives? Have you located an entrance to the underground silo? Negative, sir. If there is one, it's well camouflaged. If there is one. What does that mean, Lieutenant? Uh... We have yet to carry out a full search. We'll find it, sir. You took a risk giving up the element of surprise, Lieutenant. But it looks like it paid off. No casualties and clean work. Thank you, sir. Nonetheless, any holdout Iraqis might now be on high alert. My team's ready for anything, Colonel. That went smoothly. You think? Got the place locked down tighter than the virgins. Do not finish that sentence, Corporal. Are they ready for questioning? Yeah, just don't ask them any tough physics questions. Let's go. Stay sharp. If anyone so much as raises an eyebrow, I want to know about it. Copy that. I don't know about you guys, but something doesn't feel right about this place. Oh, yeah? So is that this, uh, woman's intuition I keep hearing about? Yeah, you want to find out what happens when you piss it off? Stay still. I'm just going to pat you down. السلام عليكم يا أخي لازم أسأل السؤال ولازم تقول الحقيقة فين مدخل مخزن السلاح I'll make him talk Stand by I've got this هسألك مرة ثانية فين مكان المخزن؟
the hell is that? Some kind of effigy. Possibly pagan. Ada. Hatarafu Rayim. Okay. Uh, I think curious is better. So, yeah, I want to like look for information. Maybe you can help me out. What the fuck? Into can henna. I've had enough of this. Corporal, keep an eye on the captives. You heard him, Marine. I mean, if I said fuck that shit, I will probably destroy the thing or something. He will probably destroy the thing or something, so... Yeah, I don't think that is good. So, alright guys, yeah, I think I will stop this video right here and then continue in the next one. So, be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And please give this video a like and share this out to your friends. Yeah, that will really help me out. So, really thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys soon. Bye.